And I'm going, all right, when, when, when are you going to put the game out, guys? Come on. When, when are you going to put the game out? All right. Where are we going? Chaos Circle. Chaos Spells. Spell upgrades and passive skills. Uh, what's the other one? Lightning. Ooh, I could start off with Lightning Bolt. I think we'll do that. Alex to Star Sector is like tying into RimWorld. What, where everybody who plays the game acts like they're on a first name basis with the developer? <laughs> I always, I've always kind of been amused by that with games where everybody who plays the game just refers to the dev developer by first name. Usually means that the developer is doing a good job. That's usually what it means. The kind of fun thing about lightning bolts is it, uh, you can hit multiple things in a line. But it doesn't do as much damage initially. Alright, so that's all of my pickups. We can get out of here. Sweet, and this is just bats. Let's just start on that healing potion. Well, as long as... One thing I will say about uh, Star Sector, though, as long as it's not, not like the RimWorld relationship where, <laughs> at least for me, I just slowly learned to hate the guy. <laughs> I seem to have painted myself into a not-so-great spot right now. Fire seven bolts of chaotic energy at random units in a cone. Each bolt randomly deals nine fire damage, nine lightning damage, or nine physical damage. Only eight charges. You also just grab chain lightning. That helped. Oh, come on. Well, at least I can hit both of you there. Well, that was a terrible floor. Like I said, terrible floor. Let's just pick everything up and then we'll go grab upgrades. I need a health potion. That's got health. Front fire or dark fire spell. That one is dragon. That one just has a shield. I think I'm going this side because... Uh, Screw the other route. Thunderstrike. Nine charges. Just does a bunch of damage. We'll buy that. And uh, let's level up Lightning Bolt with more max charges. And uh, more damage. We're going topside. I mean, who fucking cares? People on Steam are so needy, it's actually kind of upsetting. Like, seeing people starting to scream that Dwarf Fortress is vaporware, it's like, do you even, like, understand what that term means? Because <laughs> I don't think you do. 
It's just, it's, I don't know. Pe people who, um, the, the wider Steam community is, is a very frustrating thing. Children, maybe? I think that there's just very annoying people on the internet. Like the person I just banned. Who don't realize that they're incredibly annoying. Who <laughs> aren't actually, like, offering any value to anybody. Have a good lurk. We will see ya. Pi, thanks for swinging by, dude. Nice. Is that in range? Almost looks like it, but it's not. Wow. I just want that gone. Which basically funded the game for 10 whole years. I mean, if you have money, just keep developing it. It's a weird game, Walsadar. It's a really strange game. It's kind of like Mountain Blade in space, but then again, there's lots of games where it's like, oh, it's kind of like Mountain Blade in this thing. I feel like people should just make more of those because <laughs> that, that style of sandbox is just infinitely entertaining. All right, well, we got another healing potion. Fire circle, ice circle, sorcery. Well, none of those are helpful. <laughs> but what do I want to fight? Mantis trolls and annoying fire lizards. Eh, which one's got the most health pots? That one does. That's the one we're going for. Although this enhances fire spells, so maybe I do want to grab a fire spell. Fireball, let's do that. Enhanced fireball, there we go. So now I have an enhanced fireball. Who doesn't want an enhanced fireball in their lives? Levy. If the game is good, people don't care about that. You want to wait until that stuff kind of bad? I I always feel like No Man's Sky is like the worst example of an overpromised game, because I was thinking about this the other day, where in many ways, many games that I love are very similar <laughs> to No Man's Sky. You know, what is Dwarf Fortress? It's a game that Tarn Adams gets really excited about and promises everything and does it eventually. What is No Man's Sky? It's a game that had a developer who was very excited about his video game and promised a lot of things. And so far, seems to be doing them all, eventually. I've never fully understood the um, belligerent hatred towards that game. It's just whiny Sony fans, I guess. And a studio that kind of just fucked themselves sideways. <laughs> Mostly of their own doing, but. All right, so if I just. Teleport down here. And I can firebolt that. Firebolt that. Firebolt there. 
What's up, darling? It's my last thunder strike. What's this game like? You've never seen it? It's sort of like... If you've ever played the original Gauntlet, it's like somebody made that into a roguelike. Because that's very much what this game is. That, that's what it was pitched as to me. And it's very, very fun. It's very hard, but very fun. And I'm no good at it, so don't expect high-quality gameplay. Alright, that's my last fireball. Now I need to use a mana pot. Good thing there's one on this floor. Alright. Well, now we're in a little bit of a better space. So let's let's just do this. Those things seem to be on my side, so I'm just gonna let them go do their thing. And there they go. Which I think is the power up from the fireball spell that I have. All right, let's um, go see what I can afford up here, because ice spells are cheaper. Let's grab icicle. Very simple spell. I like the simple heavy fire spells. <laughs> you want your 18 quintillion worlds with full of stuff to do, okay? I mean, they want that, but with multiplayer, which they have now. So if we're, if we're still talking about No Man's Sky, it's like they already have that. They added that to the video game. It took them a bit, but they did it. I don't know. I... I also was never super excited about No Man's Sky, so I just, I, I'm incapable of getting upset at that game because I was like, that's overhyped. Enhances spell with 100% minion range, all right? That one's just a ruby heart. That one's got two healing potions and a mana potion. That's probably where we're going. Yeah, we're going that route. I have five healing potions. Damn. That's actually a lot more than I thought I had. Um, right, where's the most monster spawners? There's two down here. You know, I might just go full stupid on this map. I'm going to go here, and I'm going to summon a dragon. Well, more than one dragon. I'm just going to walk over here while they do work for me. I can do that two more times. Although, I think those guys are actually healing. <laughs> Pretty sure these guys here are actually, like, getting healed back. 100% resist lightning. Yeah, there they go. <laughs> there you go. 100% resist lightning and 100% resist poison. These are, uh, lightning damage. Alright, well, good, good thing I have fireballs and, uh, icicles to deal with these guys. Kind of tempted to just teleport behind them, but I think I'm just gonna let them do their thing. Now that's Chain Lightning, Thunderstrike, Fireball. I don't want to accidentally kill my own dragons, though. Uh, there we go. Just letting all of these thunder clouds go away. But yeah, no, this game is cool because it has an extremely in-depth, interesting magic system. Um, I would like to preface it that I do make mistakes and I'm not very good at this game. And uh, avoid backseating if at all possible because discovery and making mistakes is the fun of these games for me. Being informed of how to do things is never gonna be fun for me. There we go. Let's just wait for all that to disappear and press A. 
and figure out where we're headed. Interesting. How come I have to walk there manually? That's weird. I guess the auto pickup can't go past a shrine. Huh. You're definitely picking this up in the near future. Uh, Metalhead, favorite band. Or favorite band that you're listening to right now. Go. Whenever I see anybody with the word metalhead in their name, I, I have to, I have to, I just, I have to. It's right there. Slayer? Really? I've seen Slayer twice. Um, not the biggest Slayer kid. I, I'm, I'm definitely not. I am, uh, m much, m hmm. I mean, fucking Slayer, but also like, eh. <laughs> If I'm given the option, it's like, who do you want to see again? Slayer or animals as leaders? I'd, I'd be like, yeah, animals as leaders. If you're given the option, Slayer or Meshuga, I'd choose Meshuga. If, you're, if I'm given the option between like Slayer or, I don't know, Machine Head, I'd choose Machine Head. Also, sorry that you missed the actual Dungeon Man's Dungeon Man's. Hi, what's up? I did go and die, so that, 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 was, the, that, was, that was the problem. But these days, I'm way too into, like, Fu Manchu and uh, shit like that <laughs> to listen to much thrash. I like going to thrash shows. I don't like listening to thrash. Oh, Path? Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Someone on your Discord said that you were playing? Yeah, I, I, I was. I put, like, three hours into a run and then... Uh, stepped into a hall of champions and got fucking stung like two shot. But, you know, like, just, it was my own fault. I, I literally said out loud, I'm like, I shouldn't go into that portal. And then I went into the portal. You know, it's just, it is what it is. What are we, uh, putting this on? Whenever this spell or a minion is summoned, deals damage to an allied unit, Redeal that damage to all enemy units in a fortile radius. Kind of want to do chain like lightning on that, but that seems kind of bad. <laughs> Although, if it's an allied unit, unless I hit myself with one of these, it's not going to do anything. So I guess I'm going to put that onto fireball. Work juggernaut? No. We know like. Although I do need that health. And you've got an Earthquake Orb. I do have seven healing potions, which is kind of a lot, it feels like. I don't like that. <laughs> How about this one? Much better. We're going to do this one. I, I don't care if there's less resources. We're going this route. Hmm. Debating on whether or not I should just use that health potion. <laughs> Might. Also kind of want to just... Throw on lightning. 24 lightning to the center, 9 fire. 6 physical damage and then 6. Okay, well, this is my best shot then. Eat chain lightning. I'm just gonna keep doing this. <laughs> Any video game with chain lightning in it make me happy. Chain lightning is pretty good. Are you fucking spawning more of those into existence? Excuse me? That's a thing that can happen? The hell? I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I 
I think I'm just gonna kill this guy. Or try to kill him and fail. Then <laughs> just jump over here. Cause screw all of this. Give you a fireball and a chain lightning spell? What happens when you run into enemies that are immune to fire and lightning? And that'll happen. This game will do that to you. It'll be like, oh, what 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 abilities do you have? Okay, well here's a room. Here's two different directions, and both of them are just filled with units that you actually can't do damage to. Have fun! That's how I lost my best run in this. Because both directions were just filled with enemies that I just couldn't do damage to. It was, uh, it was a trip. One day I'll beat this game. It's not today, though. What, the you just can't hit anything? I feel like I really should have played more Diablo. Because it's so many, like, people's formative game. Whereas I'm just like, I yeah, never got into Diablo. <laughs> never got into anything Blizzard. Just their everything just never, never clicked, I guess. I feel like it should have. That's what I wanted. Perfect. You too as well. Splat. Kind of just want to teleport down there. I do have the one teleport left. It's also kind of a waste. Or is it though? Usually end because you get overwhelmed by enemies without being able to hit spawners. I mean, hitting spawners in this game is the most important thing you can do. Lightning Bolt also deals fire and arcane damage. Holy and dark damage. Let's do fire and arcane. And give you extra range. That's quite literally just let me hit more things. Much better. Also have icicles, which I should be using. I can hear an alarm going off in my neighbor's apartment above me, like a wake up alarm, like a like a beep 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 beep, beep sound. It's very faint, but I have absurdly good hearing. <laughs> It's been going off for about 30 minutes now. It's gotta be like a stove or something that's real mad that the time cha time changed. Let's just snipe that. And also snipe this. I have the range, might as well do it. Yeah, without the lightning bolt upgrades, I wouldn't be winning here. <laughs> it's doing a lot more damage. I kind of wish that, like, I could bind things to things that weren't just 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Like, I really like the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 skills style of doing things, but... It's a little bit... I don't know. It starts to run into the tome problem for me, where it's like, Every button does something! Which button am I supposed to hit? I don't know if anybody else ever runs into that problem, but I certainly do. All right, uh, realm six, and I got two skill points. I think we'll just sit. But where are we going? 
Gorks, gnomes, great. Well, we could just do. I don't know what a ward circle is. Uh, I don't want to fight hellhounds or floating eyeballs. Let's do this. But fuck that layout with a shovel. What about this layout? I don't like these enemies, but let's see what the layout's like. Ugh, all so bad. Yeah, I, I'm just... Part of the reason I'm mad that I didn't play Diablo when I was younger is because my eyes have gotten significantly worse over the years to the point where I know I wouldn't be able to play it for very long. Like, I just... I don't see well enough to play those style of games. So it kind of sucks. Yeah, we're going to do this one. Could be a little bit less 8-bit. I'll bet you that would be really easy to mod. But I'm also not a developer, so what the fuck do I know? Nothing is the answer to that. Absolutely nothing is what I know. Uh, icicle. I don't know. I think this game has a style, and I think that it hits its style more or less perfectly. Like, if I... If I could, like, openly just praise this game for something, it would be it, it has a style, and it nails it. And with it, when it comes to visuals or style in any game, that's either going to be awesome or suck, and you're going to hate it. <laughs> it's one of the two. And I think that that's totally fair. If you're like, eh, it's a little bit too 8-bit. It's like, okay, yeah, I get it. All right, well, I should probably use up the last of my mana and stuff. All right, let's just use this mana potion. I'm sitting on. Reminds you of Joust? I mean, it's, like I said, this game has a style and it's perfectly um, hitting it, in my opinion. Let's just do this. Didn't do as much as I wanted it to, but let's do it again. Because <laughs> it's satisfying. Actually, never mind, this is doing as much as I wanted it to. Perfect. How to clear the fucking room. Hell yeah. Um. At least I'm just like slapping these things to death. Really? Do you have to spawn there and there? Like, I guess that was the only places they could spawn because the rest were holes. Let's move one foot closer so I can just get all three of you. And there we go. There. Have I played much Brogue? It's probably my favorite roguelike, yeah. I've never beaten it. I've gotten to the last floor before, but I've never actually finished Brogue. <laughs> no aim sniping? Explain? I'm trying to think what aim sniping means. I have this perfectly good cup of coffee that I'm letting get cold. What is wrong with me? Um, the problem is, is this circle's kind of useless to me. Enhances spell with, whenever you use this item, gain one charge of this, whenever, whenever you use an item, gain one charge of this spell. That's not a lot. 
Enhance the spell with 75 plus minion damage. Sorcery circle. Well, like everything I have is sorcery, so we should go this route. I think I'm just going to start here. Just clear that. Owie. I don't like you at all. I do not like you. Roll dice and deal 666 dark damage to six random enemies. Uh, let's do that. Let's do that the second time. Also, you can just go away, and so can you. These guys should not exist. I'm going to chain lightning you, which didn't actually do what I wanted you to do. Uh, you stop existing, please. Still not dead, really? Okay, you know what? I'm going to deal with you. Yikes. Kind of wish that... There we go. You, uh, let's just use this. Perfect. So it's just the one thing left down at the bottom now. Most of the items you want to target a specific enemy, most spells are AoE. I'm still not sure what the term target sniping means because I've literally never seen that before. <laughs> Which maybe makes me look like an idiot, but that's perfectly normal. Oh, okay. But also my brain is like a sieve for that kind of information. Sorcery spells... Um. Kind of want to level up Fireball with a bigger radius. Ash Ball? That's a Pokemon thing. I don't trust that. Uh, fireball randomly deals arcane or holy fire damage. Yes, please. Uh, what else can we do? Let's give you radius. And max charges. I kind of wish I could select multiples of these at once. And range. Yes, please. All of those things. All right, where are we going? Sorcery circle. Mana potion. I mean, I got plenty of heals. Fire circle. But I just upgraded the fire. Dark, arcane, or lightning with that. But then I have to fight all of that shit, which I really don't want to. Then again, all of these are kind of no fun. Oh, I see what, I understand what you mean now. Okay. I get it now, Curse. Have you missed anything? Um, I'm not sure when you left, Bobtron, but uh, I probably died. <laughs> That's a safe assumption. I like this area. I can do a lot in here. We're gonna do this side. So far, so good. But yeah, generally, uh, Those motherfuckers look like Yoda. 
These guys. Does that not look like Yoda? He's even got a fucking lightsaber. Just make his, like, robe a little bit gray, browner-ish. Defo Yoda? Okay, so I'm not the only person who, who, who sees this. Oh, also, play Dungeon Mans. I'm giving you a nifty little pink badge to know that you're important. Um, Because I will be streaming more Dungeon Mans this week and this, this month because my patrons have demanded I play it. So it is the game I have to either get good at, beat, or give up and decide I hate by the end of the month. <laughs> Hmm. At least I'm not the only person getting massive Yoda vibes from those. Boom. Ow. Can you fucking not? One thing I wish this game would do is I really wish that it would um, put the... next spell that you cast in the same spot, if that makes sense. Nice. <laughs> That's very satisfying to do. So crunchy. All right, I need heals. I just need to move like two more tiles forward. How the f fuck did you do that? Okay, hold on, this is not good. Let's just go over here. Yeah, <laughs> four HP. Um. Are these guys doing arcane damage? Nope, they're doing fire damage. I need a fire shield, which I do not have. I do, however, have this. Well, that cleared the room a little bit. At least I can help. By killing my own dragons. You know, just as a dragon master would do, is just, just, you know, kill, kill your own dragons and stand out of the way of their fire so um screw the little yoda guys they hurt <laughs> that's that's what i have to say from that whole thing screw the little yoda guys they fucking hurt um well i have no more upgrades for my fireball but I could buy like Blaze Rip. Combust Poison. Nah. Deal two fire damage in a two tile burst around each affected enemy equal to one times around a poison. Uh, consume all poison on enemy units. All right, so I eat their poison in exchange to do more. I don't like that. <laughs> uh, deal 22 fire damage in a vertical line. And 22 holy damage in a horizontal line. Stun demon and undead units in the affected area. Huh. Let's do that. Holy fire. Mana potions. I want this one. It's got the ruby heart. I don't like these things, though. Do not like them at all. Fortunately, they die quickly, so. Oh, shit. I just got an achievement. Apparently, they added an achievement for getting to level 10. So I now have an achievement in this game. <laughs> this is new to me. Unless that's always been there, in which case I thought I got further in this game. <laughs> Let's just see what Holy Fire does. 
A little bit anticlimactic. Yeah, I think it's delete all the poison stacks on the enemy, but I also have nothing that does poison damage, so it would be completely useless on me. This game will also, like, doesn't have any problem giving you a spell that's absolutely useless to you. Ow. You resist everything, basically. Except for physical, which I don't really do. <laughs> well, actually, I can do that. I don't like those green guys very much. Fifty percent resist fire, so I guess I can fireball you. What? Guess I just got moved over here. I have a feeling this is where I die. I don't think I can beat this level. Although, I can use a portal key. That portal is now open. So I have to get down there. I'm just going to use one of these mana pots. Oh, of course, you got 100% resist lightning damage, too. Oh, shit. <laughs> they disrupted me into an area that's better for me. What is the odds of that? Can you stop doing that? <laughs> that would be cool. I'm going to use the Earthquake Orb. Now I just need to get to that. That's all I need to do is get to that. It sounds so easy when I say it. Owie. Thank you. <laughs> eh. I'm so close. I... Okay. I realize I still had four healing potions left. Yeah. <laughs> He's a troubler, not hot a helper? You mean not a helper? <laughs> I mean, like, you can say that again. He's a big troubler. Not a bad run, though. We got halfway through the game. Bring out your dead. What do you think, chat? Do we have another run in us? I guess we do, because Bellinair's raiding us. <laughs> I was about to ask. I'm like, so what, what, what do you think? We got another run of this? And, uh, clearly we do. Thank you very much for the raid, Bellinair. How was uh, generic third-person shooter number 12? I mean, <clears throat> uh, I, 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 actually, no, I, I genuinely can't remember the name of it. How was generic third-person shooter number 12? Outriders, that's the name of it. How was that thing that looks like garbage? <clears throat> I mean, generic. You really enjoyed it? Enough that you